Christmas. All I wanna do is kill Santa Claus. Beat him in the head and kick him in the balls. In Spaghetti Land, we don't believe in Saint Nick. Go pedophile with the kids on a stick. It's meatball rolling around after you. Choking out Rudolph with a spatula. Stop Seriously, you're still an old dirty rotten motherfuckers. Christmas Eve. No matter what happens. I mean, it is what it is. I don't think I am, but I'm just saying. I can't believe you even said that, dude. Not because, just because you think that don't mean everybody else thinks it. My mom and dad thought it. That you was a no good, dirty, rotten motherfucker. Never heard him say that one time. They've done every fucking thing for you, dude. Never heard him say that one time. And well, they ain't gonna tell you. What's it gonna do with your mom and dad? Because you're no good, dirty, rotten motherfucker. What's it got to do with my dad? <laughs> Why'd you think yourself so funny? Because it is funny. <laughs> Not for you. Hey, you think all your Her kids are fucking gone. fuck ups and no good, dirty, rotten motherfuckers and all that good stuff? I mean,. No, no, no. Well, you ain't, you ain't even, you ain't even got on your second, the second one yet. What? Can't wait to get on the second one. Second one. He's gonna tell you go fuck yourself, and then you're gonna get pissed off and just sit there. <laughs> That's all you're gonna do. Do what? <laughs> you right. you we, ain't even got on your second one yet. What's my second one? Your second one? What? Your second? Kid that's a no good dirty rotten motherfucker, and, he, you're, and he's gonna tell you go fuck yourself, and you're just gonna sit there and pat like it. By the way, around. I hope that motherfucker don't even come back. I know, that's all you're gonna do. Just saying. What are you, what, what, what are you saying here? You think I'm gonna I'm, stand I'm up to him? Is that what you're saying? Well, you bitch at me, but you don't bitch at him because. The he, motherfucker ain't been here! He's here right now! No, he ain't. Or he was here then. Uh, what well, 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 you want me to, uh, well, well, I'll wait till he gets back, what do you want me to get on him about? I don't care. Like, I already got him back right out of there driving a goddamn car. Fucking use him move back over here where he belongs. You don't see where I'm going with this now? Yeah, you got more fuel on him than you do me. Huh? You got more fuel on him than you do me. Why are you bitching to me? Because you're no good, dirty, right? Oh, my God. Seriously? I don't think you are. I don't either. He's stingy. Well, he might be a little stingy. If, if I had the fucking money, if I didn't make nine fucking dollars an hour, if I if, if I got if I went somewhere and I had nine, you know, let's say I went to Burger King, I'd buy everybody something. If I had the fucking money, that ain't what I, that ain't what I'm even talking about. What the fuck are you talking about then? You're because you're fucking stingy. About what? My crossbow is almost about you... every goddamn. I don't care what it is. You're stingy about it. You don't want nobody playing your Xbox. You, you know why you do that? Because you own. Let me tell you why you do it. Because you don't own a goddamn thing. I don't care about anybody thing. You don't own nothing. All that you own, you don't even own that. Because I own half of it. That truck and that crossbow. It's all the fuck you own. I don't care about anybody playing my Here I am. I'm getting ready to set you up, dude. Because you ain't never going to fucking have nothing. This game in the Listen to this, Janet. Listen here. I'm getting ready to set this motherfucker up. Because he ain't never going to have nothing. Wouldn't even have, wouldn't even have a place to, cause I'm gonna tell you what, dude, I'm gonna tell you straight up. If I was gonna sell this place and move over my mom, dude, you ain't gonna move over. Where would you go? Answer me that. Where would you go? Well, I had to deal with something until, uh, huh? I just had to deal with something until I became a driver. And what, where are you gonna live at? I don't know. Uh, well, I don't I don't know. Up here on, uh, National Turnpike or any Jefferson Freeway? Now, is that where you're going to move your Xbox to? I said if I was a driver, I'd have to go to my own place. I'd have to deal with whatever I could do and go with You wouldn't be able to do nothing. How the fuck do you know? Mother, because I can add. Apparently not very good. <laughs> Why do you say that? Yeah, if I ain't got a place to stay. What? Until I'm a driver. Then I'm making like fucking twelve dollars an hour, twelve fifty, wherever it is. And, and then what are you gonna do? Uh, bet a four balance place. You you want to tell him or you no, want me? To, you want me to tell him? I'm not talking about a house. Before you fucking go into that category, Mister. Uh, yeah, just blow, you blow everything out of proportion, dude. Seriously, you do. Well, anyway. Budget.
Anyway, I said I, I said what I was gonna say. You know what the first thing he said was? Jenna? Josh ain't gonna pay his part. He's not. First thing he said. He ain't got a job. He don't motherfucker don't want no job to got her. She keeps giving him money. He don't want no goddamn saying, job. I'm just, I'm just saying if I'm gonna stay here. Neither I'm did not, you. I'm not gonna when you didn't have no job, you didn't want no job because she give you money. How do you think I didn't want a job? Because she was giving you money. If I didn't want a job, I wouldn't be going to the job I'm at. Silly motherfucker. I mean, I wouldn't be going to the job I have now. I'd be sitting at home calling in every day. Think calling, about that for a second. Calling in where? I'd be calling in the fucking the job I have now. I'd be like, hey, I'm going to be there today. If I didn't want a job, I wouldn't go to the job I have now. No, you feel obligated to. Uh, no, I don't. Kevin. I don't feel obligated because I like my job. You what? I like my job. Well, go to work every day. I do. Well, shut up then. What the fuck are you arguing with me then? I ain't arguing you one brought it up. <laughs> All right. I just, I don't understand your argument here. I really don't. What do you mean? What do you all want from me? I mean, I'm going to work I don't every want day. I give you all the money that I owe you all. And I mean, what the fuck am I supposed to do? I don't have any problems. Exactly. I'm just telling you. Well, she ain't. And then I'm a no good, rot, dirt, no good, dirty, rotten. Well, you've been a no good, dirty, rotten motherfucker for a while. See, it's you ain't. Let me tell you this, dude. Sure, bitch. Let me. T look. You're never going to get out of that dirty, rotten motherfucker because of what you've done, mom and dad. You're never going to get out of that. I don't care what you do, how many fucking kids you save out of the road. I don't care. I'm glad you're still you. going to be a no good, dirty, rotten motherfucker because of the way you've done my fucking mom and dad. I'm glad it's your only opinion. Oh, it was their opinion. They just never said nothing to you. You broke broke their fucking, dude. You broke their fucking hearts, so that puts you in the category of being a no good, dirty, rotten motherfucker dog. Go you. That's what that does. Get the camera. It's already on. It's not pointing at nobody. That's what it does, dude. Motherfuckers told me to my face. Look at me. You broke their hearts. They said they didn't say that. Do what? So you just said they didn't say that. No, they said it to me. Brandon broke our hearts, dude. Exactly what they said to me. So that puts you in the category of being a no good, dirty, rotten, motherfucking doggone you. So there. And you'll never get out of that because they're dead and gone. And you can't, you ain't even been up to the goddamn graveyard. Now, have you? Actually, I did. How, how long? How, how many times? Seriously. On your dad's birthday. Huh? On your dad's birthday. This is June 16th. Come on now. I did, fucker. I went. Alright, okay. Oh, when, when was it? June what? 16th. 16th. Mom didn't, Mom didn't die until February. I understand that. You been up there? No. Exactly. I can rest my case. They gave you a goddamn car, mother, and you fucking broke their goddamn hearts, and they gave you a fucking truck, dude. Because you know what? They give the hour to because they knew you you would never fucking have nothing, dude. You know why? Because you're a no good, dirty, rotten motherfucker, dude. Why did they even come here and start raping kids in the first place? I really don't. You should never come in here, then. If you didn't want to hear it, you should never come in here. You know, I'm going to tell you, if you want to come in here and listen, then I'm going to tell you. I'm fine with that. It's just, it's just, it's just funny how you go with these, with the shit that doesn't even, I don't, I don't, I don't see how you blame the shit on me. What? What am I blaming on you? Well, everything. No, I ain't, I ain't blaming on you because they died. Well, I'm blaming, that? I'm blaming you because you didn't go over to see them before they died. Okay. Okay. Before Brendan was born, you didn't go see them. Ever. Christmas. No, you're Christmas. wrong there. I never saw you over there. Huh? How you know, Buffer? You were never over there. Yeah, I was. When? I was over cutting your pep grass forever. Your <laughs> dad's grass. Well, you're a fucking liar. Swartz a liar. Motherfucker, <laughs> Brent Jones been cutting that grass for, for fucking the last four or five years. I know, about 2005. Uh, I stopped cutting it because Pepwell said he could, he said, he said, come over Saturday and cut it. And when I got there, it's already cut. 
Yeah, I sat there and hung out with him, you know, sat there and fucking talked on the front porch and shit, and... Uh, for about four or five minutes? No. For and then, an then, hour or two. What? About an hour or two. <laughs> Hell no. Hey, go tell me what I didn't do. What I did. Well, because I know you didn't. Yeah, I did. Well, well then why'd you break their hearts here? I'm not sure. I, I, well, I know. Could you fucking quit coming over here? Cause you quit coming over there, dude. The only time you went over, it's when you was getting ready. They were getting ready to give you some money. Then you go whole. Then you go whole year. A whole year. Those motherfuckers don't even live three miles from us. You wouldn't go over there until they was gonna give you some money, and then you'd go over. Now you tell me that don't fall underneath the fucking category of being a no good, dirty, rotten motherfucker dog on you. Now it does it or not? See, but I don't see any difference between you're their own son and you didn't go there until Brendan was born. What's the difference? See, y'all, you want me to tell you what's why? What's the difference? You want me to tell you why? Because yeah, I was fucking mad. Was you mad at him? Every time I go over there, man, all of a act like I would, she didn't want me to be there. They got too many rules. Oh, now you're changing your story. Oh, okay. They got too many rules. So, so, yeah, there's too many rules for me to go over there. It just seemed like I was burdening her. It just seemed like... Did I tell you that? Yeah, several times. It just seemed that way. I swear to God. Whatever. Whatever. Glad it's over. Yeah, it's over. your fat ass back there. Leave me alone. Wait a minute. How do you say it? Is? Leave me alone. That's what you do. You either sit there and pout or you go in your room and slam your door. Oh, Kathleen's back. Kathleen's going to say, oh, hell no. <laughs> Fuck. Dust, come over and turn this fucking camera off. Stoopy. Janet, come here and turn this goddamn camera off. He needs some more ammo. What? He needs some more. He's going to put the dog cat on here and put you on there as fat cat going running your mouth like the fat cat. Bloody Christmas. All I want to do is kill Santa Claus. Beat him in the head and kick him in the balls. In Spaghetti Land, we don't believe in Saint 